quality of the two components. This one is extremely uh, nice and high end. Uh, in fact, as you see, I've already turned it on here. You see it flashing 200. That's because the um, pencil iron over here is setting in its holder. Uh, you have your three preset temperatures, as you can see. Um, I've got my lowest end at 465, uh, my middle temp at 625, my highest at 725. Well, lead-free solder starts flowing pretty good at about 425 to 430 degrees. So I have it where it will just barely flow, barely do pretty good. That's for really small work like uh, 22 gauge wire, 24 gauge wire, several leads, things like that. You can solder them and do it really well, but you're not putting too much heat and melting anything. Neck size up, 625 degrees Fahrenheit. That works for anywhere of your medium size wire, 16 gauge wire, uh, maybe down, maybe 15, 14 gauge wire, maybe, and on down. The 725, I use those to solder 8 and 10 gauge wire with EC5 connectors when you really want to be able to put some heat to something. But at the same time, you're not putting so much heat out. You're just, you know, if you're not careful, you'll ruin the solder and, and can't get...